What happened to this guy? Reconnecting. Paul, Paul huh? writing. I did not hear you. I did not hear you. Go ahead. What you were saying? What you were saying? This, this is follower. You are, I, I'm, I'm saying clearly, you okay. are not Jesus follower. You are Christian. Hello, hello, hello. I am a Christian. Okay, what Christian mean? What, what is the name of Christian mean? I'm saying that you are you are a Christian, but you are not Jesus follower. Okay, are you just are you Jesus? You're not different. Are you Jesus You're follower? Different. Are you Jesus follower? Christian mean uh, like it is a bad signal, I think. <laughs> Christian, it is like you that uh, obey that all all they have the Paul rating, while the Jesus follower do not have Paul rating. Why all Jesus Bulls followers? No, not have Bulls rating. What what what? So for example, the twelve the twelve disciple, it is uh, Jesus. They are they are Jesus follower, not Christian. Christian only after year of fifty. After the first consul in Jerusalem, uh -huh. so you are you are Christian, not this follower. Yeah, but you see, you are you are very stupid because the uh, the Bible written long before that council, and it says that those who they are believers in Jesus, they are called the Christians. Go to the book of Acts and find in chapter eleven, verse number twenty six. So you are stupid. Secondly, the Quran mentioned Paul as a messenger of God. As an example, if we go to chapter 36, verse number 14, you will see the Quran speaking about three messengers. Can you tell me who are they? Doesn't matter what you I believe. You can you give me I can see. you give me the name? You, are a, you, you are a coward. You are a coward. You are a coward. And actually the Quran is copying the writing of, of, of Paul. Paul, can you name for me one thing Paul he said is against God? Paul he it's said, Paul, Paul he said, gamblers will not go to heaven. Your Quran copy the same exact verses of Paul. Those who drink, no. those the drunk, no, 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 those who do gambling. Don't ask me. And I, I don't, I'm not Just asking you. You are a coward. Prove to me that Paul is not the messenger of Jesus. Actually, if we go right now and read in Ibn Kathir, we will find that Paul was one of the disciples of Jesus, and he met Jesus in the way of Damascus, and Jesus made him blind. Is that true? This is written in your book. Hello? Paul said. Hello? Is it true? Is it true? Is it true? Is it true? I want you to say yes or no. You are a liar or say this is true. Is it true? In the book of Ibn Kathir, it says that Paul was a messenger of... It, is it true? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm not asking you. I'm not asking you. I am. I am. I am. I'm not asking you. I want just a very simple yes or no. Is it true that Ibn Kathir said in his book in many places, and I will show you other other scholars that Paul was a messenger of Jesus, and he was a decent man, and he became a Christian after Jesus. He made him lose his vision make him blind and then he repent to Jesus and he asked him to make him see again and then he became a decent man preaching the gospel. Is it true? It is true as per your book but I don't believe. This is not my book you idiot. Ibn Kathir is my book. It is Paul said in, in his writing. Shut up. I'm saying Ibn Kathir. Is Ibn Kathir my book? No, 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 this is my turn to ask you. You already asked me a ton of questions. I, no, I am not, I, I'm not asking you. You are the one who opened the topic. We are discussing the topic. This is not a new topic. No, 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 is I'm Ibn Kathir, you coward. The, you coward. Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me make everybody, let me make everybody, let me make everybody, let me make everybody laugh at you. Can you show me one place the Quran says Paul is a bad person? Shut up, please hear me. Shut no, up, son of Muta. Shut up, son of Muta. Can you show me you are a person who said you follow the Quran only? How come the Quran never say Paul only is a bad person? Are, you already asked me 100 questions. I am not, I am not asking you. We are talking about Paul. We are discussing the topic. If Paul was bad, why? how come your prophet never mentioned Paul as a bad person? Why your prophet never mentioned Paul as a bad person? You only ask me, I will ask you. I'm not asking you no more. I'm not asking you no more. We are discussing the topic of Paul. You said I follow Paul. Listen, coward. Listen, coward. Listen, coward. Listen, coward. Listen, coward. Listen, coward. Son of Muta. 
Can you show me one verse Paul he said is like, shut up shut up you Muslims are a bunch of cowards you Muslims are a bunch of cowards and you will not answer the question can you show me one verse Paul he said to be ashamed of it shut up shut up shut up shut up shut up shut up coward 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 can you show me can you show me one verse will make Paul a bad person can you show me you said I follow the teaching of Paul shut up coward Son of, son, me, son, of Aisha, son, son of Aisha, son, son of Aisha. I'm not asking you. I'm not asking you. I, you said, you said I follow Paul. Are you said, shut up. You see the pain? You see the pain? It's your turn. It's your turn. Can you show me the verse will make Paul a bad person? You said I follow Paul. Do you have a proof? Do you have a proof that I follow? Do you have a proof that I follow Paul? Do you have a proof? Do you have a shut up? Shut up! You accuse me. You accuse me. You accuse me of something, coward. You accuse me of something. Can you prove it that I follow Paul, not Jesus? Go ahead. Show me. Can you open the camera? Can you open the camera? I want to see your wife dancing. Is she dancing too? You are a coward. You are a coward. You and your wife is dancing and you are a coward. Show me where, prove to me how we are following Paul. I'm listening. Go ahead. Ah, what is the difference of Christ, Christian and Jesus follower? That is my question. I have only one question. The, you already asked I, I, one I, ans question. I answered you. You see, when I answered you, you I start talking. You said to me, you are not giving my time. And your wife start dancing, shaking her ass. Shame on you. So I'm asking you now. You said you said you you are a Christian. You are a Christian. You are following Paul. You are not following Jesus. Approve it. Go ahead. Yeah, you ask me. What is the difference between Christian? I am not. I'm not asking you anything. Go ahead. You are making accusation. Finish it. You said I'm not following Jesus. Approve it. Go ahead. Now I am asking you one question. What's wrong with you? Uh, Go ahead, prove the point. You did not finish. You said I'm not following Jesus. Prove it. Go ahead. The Jesus follower, Jesus follower, hmm. do not have Paul writing. Okay. If we take Paul writing away, is the teaching of John and Luke and Mark are different from Paul writing? Yes. It okay, Pro prove it. Okay, no, okay, go ahead. Prove it. Guys, guys, yes. He said yes. Prove it. Go ahead. Now I am still looking for the Christian scholar. How is the Christian? You are a stupid donkey. Paul? Prove that Paul teaching is different from the, the gospel, the four gospels. Because in order to prove that I'm following Paul, not following Christ, then and you are, you are the one who said that Paul teaching is different from the Bible teaching. Okay, show us where it says that. Go ahead. Google, sir, go, no, I'm tired. Google Maybe boy. We'll talk again. What? Sorry, I will take some rest. What's some rest? Where are you going? No, I want your wife to shake her ass and say, give me time. Give me time. Where are you going? You coward son of Muta. So your wife, she danced for me, shaking her ass for nothing? No, you need to finish it. Show me, you coward son of Muta, what you started. Where Paul teaching is different from the four gospel. Go ahead. You can open in the YouTube. No, what do you do? I tell, 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 tell me, where is where is Paul teaching? If I follow, how if I follow Paul, I'm not following the gospel. Paul he says that God is the Messiah. John he says God is the Messiah. Luke he says God is the Messiah. Mark he says God is the Messiah. John he says the Son, the Father, the Holy Spirit. Mark he says the Son, the Father, the Holy Spirit. All of them they say the same. So how Paul teaching different teaching from the gospel? You cover son of Muta. Don't leave. You have to go. You have to. You have to get me busted. And I love it when your wife she was sh shaking herself. Okay. She is doing belly dancing for me. I'll, now you speak and speak. Please hear me, la. Don't uh, you speak only. Well, I am asking. I am asking you to talk. You said you want to leave, you coward. You just said you want to leave. You see the coward. You are the one who just said you want to leave. You want to rest. Why you want to rest? Get me busted. You said this is my time to okay. get you busted. Okay, go ahead. Listen. Listen me. Listen me. Hmm. James said. James said that the people will be saved by the God. Uh, using the works, not only the faith. While Paul said, Paul said that the people can be saved by the God only by the faith. That is why 
Christian Christianity, then the you are a coward. You are a coward. You are a coward. Both of them, they are saying the same because the Bible says in different places, no, no, no. faith without act is, is a dead faith. So look, 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 look. You, you are you are just a stupid idiot. When you say when you say without faith, Jesus, let me answer you. Let me answer you. Uh, can I answer you, please? Can I answer you? Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Okay, no, you you did. You coward. You did. The, you did the one you wanna go. You did. You just make a point. Let me answer you. Did Jesus say to the women, "Your faith save you"? I am not finished my word. That is why I don't care if you finish or not. I'm asking you. Did Jesus say it? your face? Your how? How the teaching of Paul is different from the teaching of Jesus? You just quote for me. Paul saying something in total agreement with Jesus. Use your ear. Use your ear to to listen what I said. <laughs> Why you always interrupted me? Then you claim that you win the debate. Because because it is, it is no, I did not. I did not. I did not disturb you. You you said you wanna go. This is what make me uh, 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 like I wanna I wanna have fun. Listen, listen, listen just a minute. And, and let your wife stay there, please. Don't let her go. Okay. So now what what, what happened? What, what Paul? What make Paul not a Christian? Did he say that there is no God? Why only talk, talk, and talk? I never talk. You talk. Okay, only. go, 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 go. Okay, okay, okay go, go. You talk, talk, and talk. Okay, Buddy. You in the debate? Why you okay, speak? Okay, I can Buddy. Stop to speak. The, the one who keeps saying every time I say to him, he said to me, I need to study it. Oh, I need to see it. Mouth, suddenly now, mouth, suddenly the one is complaining. I don't let him talk. How many times I ask you to talk and you don't want to talk? And now you don't you want to talk. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. What make Paul? You are reading an article, you donkey. You don't even know what you are reading. It's not even you who understand what it's written there. So, okay, tell us. Tell us what make Paul. Tell us what make Paul not a Christian. Go ahead. I will. Yeah, listen me for two minutes. Not only speak, 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 speak. Speak, speak, speak. Go ahead. And then you claim to be okay. This is the ethic of the debate. Okay, TikTok. Go ahead. You you have to improve your ethic debate. My friend, this this uh, this okay, recording I'm will be all over the I'm internet. People will, will you, you. People will die laughing at you. People will die laughing at you. Go ahead. I will tell you. Okay, go ahead. Okay, that is why already five five hundred five hundred years Catholic and Protestant are confronted confronted because hmm. of this difference between James and Paul. You read the history. Don't only talk and talk. Read the history. Only yesterday in 1999 19, 19 in Augsburg, Germany, they signed, they signed the agreement that the Protestant and Catholic will end the 500 years con contradiction. Okay, contradiction can, can I answer you? Can I answer you? You are a stupid monkey son of no, Muta because no. both, both, if we open the Bible of the Catholic and open the Bible of the Orth of, of the Orthodox and the Bible of the Protestant, we will see the same verses and all of them they agree upon it. So you are a stupid officially and you are a donkey, because it exists, it exists, it exists, it exists in the books of the three Christian sect, and you are a liar and people are laughing at you. So you said to me, I follow Paul. And to prove me wrong, you said Paul spoke about faith, you stupid idiot. Jesus spoke about faith. A woman, she is not even a Christian. A, a woman, she is not even a Christian. A man who is next to him in the cross. Shut up, son of Mata. It's time. It's my time for answer now. You, 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 made, you laid out. You laid out your case. Is, is that verse you quote for me? Let us let us let make everybody laugh at you. Is the verse you quote for me? Is the verse you quote for me from Paul? Is it exist in the book of the Protestant? Is the verse you quote? Shut up. Is the verse you quote for me exist in the book of the Protestant and the Catholic and the Orthodox? Yes or no? I'm not still waiting. <laughs> so how they are fighting for 500 years if all of them they believe in the same book? You eat a donkey. How you lie? How you lie? How you lie if the three of them they have the same verse in the same book? You are stupid. You are stupid. Okay, let us make it simple. Okay, let's see. Prove it to me. Prove it to me. What okay, hold on, hold on. I'm going to show the verses in the screen. Hold on, son of Muta. I'm going to show the verse in the screen, in the book of the Catholic, in the book of the Protestant, in the book of the Orthodox. And if they are there, it's mean you are a stupid liar. What do you think? Yeah. What? What, what do you mean? You said, you, you said the Catholic and the Protestant, they are fighting for 500 years about this verse, but it exists in their books. The, th the three Christian sect, the three Christian sect, they have the same verse and they believe in it in full. 
If if you don't want to hear me, then it's bullshit. <laughs> I did hear you, you idiot. I just said to you, isn't it true that this verse exists in the book of the Protestant? You are a liar, son of Muta, like your prophet. Isn't it true that those people, the three of them, why you don't want to, why you don't want to confront me? Confront me. I'm saying to you, is it is that is that verse? Okay, can you tell me? What, can you say again what verse we are reading? What we are talking about? What verse? Say it again. James. Okay. James said hmm. uh, people will be saved by God by the works, hmm. by faith and works. Okay. What verse? Said, what verse? What verse? What verse? What, what verse? What verse? What verse? What verse? I am not bringing my notes now. No, you have I to bring me your verse. You are you are getting me busted, you son of Muta. Give me the verse so we can laugh at you. No, yeah, yeah, because because you call me while I was in the. Will you coward? In the how you quote for me something? Note. Why you don't want to give me the verse so we can laugh at you? Because we want to put it in the screen. People either will laugh at me or they will laugh at you. So what kind of a hero? He bring his wife shaking her his ass next to me. And she say, give him time, give him time. Here we go. She will do breastfeeding for me as your prophet order her. And now you don't want to give me the verse number. So what is the verse number of James? And what is the verse number of Paul he mentioned? Otherwise, you have no point. You are a coward. Give us both. You can, if you want to stop to search Google, can you ask your wife to sing, or your wife to sing for us, says, give him time, give him time, and shake, if you don't mind. I like it. I feel bored. Hello? See the cover? I don't even know what he's talking about. You mean, look, and, and look what they are looking for. And this is supposed to make, okay, a Paul is a bad person. <laughs> Coward. Are you a follower of Paul? Or follower of Jesus. Hey, hello. He's looking in Google. Coward. What happened to you? <clears throat> I can help you. I can give you the verses if you want. I just wanted to be sure that you know what you are talking about, but obviously you are a scam. Come back, come back. I will give you the verse. I will help you, no problem. <laughs> Coward. Where are he going? He's gone? The Catholic and the Protestant, they were fighting for 500 years for this? For this. Mm. And finally, they sign agreement. Mm. Yeah. He will be back after he finishes uh, research. He's asking his wife to shake the computer. <clears throat> you see how they lie and how they fabricate? Both Paul and James, they are saying exactly the same thing. Actually, it's my fault. I did not I say to him, okay, what verses you are talking about? I thought he knew what he's talking about. I hope he did not go and do muta right now, yeah? What happened? All this time to find it? He put me in hold. He is calling some friends. All this time to find it. How embarrassing. Hmm. <clears throat> you will be back maybe, maybe tomorrow. And the funny is, the second you corner them, they say, let me talk, let me talk. You are not letting me talk. I did not finish my point. Wh what point? You just, you don't even know the verses. What the verses is saying? Do you think he will be back? Or he is gone with the wind? He is still in hold. He did not hang up. Very embarrassing cult. Paul is a great Christian. And he never disobeyed the Lord. And actually, even he is more strict in the teaching of Christ. And when you ask the Muslims, okay, why you are attacking Paul? I mean, what this is about Paul? Did your prophet ever say something bad about Paul? No. So what this is Paul is about? Why not John? Why not? Uh, yeah, because some, somebody like Dr. Zachary Naik, when they start saying Paul is bad, he is the one who created Christianity, and they are copy-paste. And now, this is what we have. A stupid idiot kid. You do not know what he's talking about. Shall I hang up on him? I think he's waiting for me to hang up so he can be saved. Because whatever, verse, whatever verses he's going to choose, both of them they are saying the same. Yeah, I think he wants me to hang up on him. So he will not say he hang up and he run. No, we will not hang up. We are waiting for shake it and bake it. Now I'm going, to, uh, after we finish here, I'm going to uh, cut the video, the part we are speaking about this guy, Sad Guru. You know he's not really important for me and we will keep in the video only uh, his his conversation with me so everybody will laugh so you guys you can download it shame on you potato all this time in hold all this time in hold
Hang up and call him? That's a good idea, hold on. Isn't that saying now? See? What happened? You put me on you, you put me on hold all this time. Why you put me on hold all this time? All this time. Yeah, just now my friend called me, so that's, oh, that's okay. why. Okay. So did you find the verses for us about James and uh, and uh, Paul, so we can get Paul busted? Uh, sorry, CP. I just I can promise you maybe in the San Francisco. My friend, my friend, my friend. You see, you're, you're an adult. You're an adult. You make me it make me angry. And you know, I shout at you, but I want to speak to you nicely, and I want you to get me busted. Honestly, I'm trying to help you. So why you want to leave now? I mean, it's it going to take you 15 minutes to find it. Find, find it, no problem. No, no, no. I will wait for you. I will wait for you because I want to see how this Paul he changed everything, man. It's disgusting. So either you prove it or you apologize before you leave. Okay, I will, I will give you the the first, but not now. I will. Well, no, 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 no. Because no, 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 no. You see, uh, an adult man, mature man. You see, you made your wife jumping, shaking her bum, and acting like a bunch of kids. You and her, very embarrassing. Give him time. Give him time. And now I'm giving you the time. And even I'm calling you back. You put me on hold. We waited for almost five minutes, seven minutes for you. And now what you want to do? You want to leave? Not today. Not today. Why not today? Why not today? What? Why? Sorry. What is embarrassing? Is it embarrassing that what you said is a lie? That Paul, but I, Paul? I, I, I'll no, 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 no. My friend, yeah. it's going to take you five minutes to finish it. It's not like a big deal. I want you to get me busted. At least you see, I was getting you busted all this time until now. Now it's your chance to get me busted. It's you who said to me, "Let me talk." It's my time to ask you. And now you ask me, you want to run away from your question? No, I am. I am not good. Today. I will prepare first, and then I will text to you. So, do you apologize for do you do you apologize for what you said against Paul, or you want to run and put the tail of the dog between your legs and run with shame? Because either you apologize, either you apologize. No, 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 no. You see, you are a man. You are a dog. No, you have to give us. You have to. You, you have to prove what you said. Otherwise, you have to agree you are a liar. Where Paul he teach something different from the teaching of Christ. No, today, today, you are the one who asked me to ask you. You said, give me time, it's time, my time to ask you. Okay, now we started. I, sh I showed you, I said to you, I said to you, listen to me, listen to me. Look, look what you do, look what you do. You are just like a kid. I'm, I'm not trying to insult you. I said, Ibn Kathir, he said, and Lucy, he said, all big Muslim scholars, they say that Paul is a messenger of Jesus. You Muslim, you insult Jesus based on what? Uh, uh, Paul, based on what? Did your prophet say that? No. Did the Sahaba say that? No. Did the Sahih Hadith say that? No. So why you are attacking Paul? So you are a fraud. Shame on you. And now you are mentioning something is absolutely false. Because, because both James and Paul and all the disciples of Jesus agree that faith without work is a dead faith. And faith will save us. It's not our work, but a faith without work is a dead faith. All of them agree on that. And this is why Jesus said, from their fruits, you shall know them. So how he will know us from our fruit? But what will save us? Our faith. Which means, a, faith, a faithful person, he is a good tree, give good fruit. It's automatic. But it's not the fruit will save you, but it is the faith. But if you have no faith, it means you are a hypocrite like Muhammad. He said to them, don't have sex when the woman, she have uh, her menstruation. And he was doing that with his wives. So this is what the Bible says, my friend, and Paul and James and all the disciples of Jesus agree on that. And the Lord, the Messiah himself, he said that clearly that when he come with the glory of his angels, he will recognize us not by our names, by our fruits. And why the fruit is there? For we have faith. And what is our faith? Is on him. So the shepherd, he knew his sheep. And he, she, the sheep, they knew their shepherd. And how they knew each other. The fruit of Jesus 
is going to lead us who is Jesus. Otherwise, anyone can come and say, I am Jesus or I am Muhammad, the coward. But we don't follow that. The fruit, my friend. So you made a statement. You cannot back it up. And now I ask you nicely to apologize for insulting Paul. Or before you go, you have to prove me wrong. This is not regarding apologize or not. This is only discussion and I will not uh, answer. No problem. Uh, Maybe. I'm asking you to finish your discussion. You see, you are the one who asked your wife to jump no, next to you, the, give him time, give him history. time. And not now killer. and now we are giving you time. You don't want to do it. Why? Just because I asked you for the verses. Embarrassing. Embarrassing, very embarrassing. You are lying. No, you, okay. You were reading for me 500 words between the Catholic and the Protestant about a verse. Why not today? Both why, the, why you are not so patient? I, I, mean, I, will I am, I am the, very patient. I am very patient. Who is the one who asked his wife, very embarrassing of you as a man to do, to bring your wife to this humiliation to her? So she jumped like a child. Give him time, give him time. And both of you, you jump like a monkey in front of me. And now I'm giving you time. You want to leave. Very embarrassing. Why do you want to leave? I want you please to get me busted. Don't leave. You see, what will happen if we stay me and you together for the coming 30 minutes? Nothing. Just do it. Go ahead. I have decided not to answer today, CP. Sorry. No, you decided to run away. You decided that you are no. falsely speaking against Paul. You have nothing to support what you said, and you went for 15 minutes lying, saying your family called you, but the fact you were serving Gogol, and you came back with nothing, because you found that both they say the same. So you could not back up what you said, and okay, then do it. Prove me wrong. Okay, you know what? Prove me wrong. Here we go. You got your chance. Prove me wrong. Give me the verses. I have decided not today. Sorry. You decided that you don't have answer. You decided that you want to withdraw okay. because you are a coward. Okay, uh, you, you want you want to be a winner? Yeah, yes, you win. Take, take no, 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 I don't. I don't, like I don't care winner. if you say I win or not. Everybody is laughing. It's, it's embarrassing. You are the one who said you want to get me busted. I have, I have decided not today. Why you don't want to get me? Answer. But why you don't want? You see, it's, we are talking all this time. A spank after a spank. We showed you your prophet is a scam. We showed you the mistakes of the Quran. You refuse to accept any Islamic interpretation for the Quran. Shame on you. You made your own interpretation, which is very funny. Even a bunny will not come with it. And even now, when I showed you about Paul, in the Islamic interpretation, he is the disciple of Jesus. You don't want to accept them. Yet you want to insult Paul, and you are claiming that I don't follow Christ, I follow Paul. When all the teaching of Paul in total agreement with the teaching of Christ and all the disciples. And when we ask you to prove what you said, you run away. So it's not about me winning. It's about Jesus winning and Muhammad is under the shoes of Jesus. This is not about me and you, my friend. That's about that Muhammad, your prophet, the child molester, the man who made verses saying any woman she want to give her vagina to me. This is not about me and, and, and Paul. We don't worship Paul. We worship the Messiah. You don't worship Muhammad, you worship Allah. But in fact, Allah is the puppy of Muhammad. And today we got him busted and you could not refute us anything. To the point, you refuse any translation, you refuse any interpretation, and you could not give us any interpretation accurately because you are fabricating things out. And when we show you what your prophets say, you say, I don't accept hadith. When we say to you, can you show us where Muhammad, uh, something nice about Muhammad, you quote for me hadith. Because you are a hypocrite. When you want, the hadith is rejected. When you want, the hadith is accepted. And then you say to me, it's time for me to ask you questions. Okay, time for I you. I will not respond today. Why you will not respond I today? I will not respond. Why? What happened? Sorry. Did your wife beat you? I decided did, not did your wife, to respond today. Did your wife beat I you? Another, I have another I'm not giving you. I'm not giving you a Sorry. chance to waste my time again, my friend. I want you to finish it today, please. About this topic. I, I don't no, 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 you have to do it now. Did your wife beat you when you, when you when you went away for 15 minutes? Did she do anything to you? Tell me, I'm like, I'm like your dad. Say, say, say what do you want to say, but I don't want to... to okay, give, give explanation. It, say, people say people are listening. Give explanation to the people who you open the topic, why you don't want to finish it. Why? What is the explanation? What happened to you suddenly? 
No, 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 no. You are the one who opened this topic, my friend. You see, you are the one who opened the topic. It was your request. Now, why you don't want to speak about it no more? What happened? Explain to the crowd. I decided next day or maybe... Okay, why you decided? Can you tell us why you decided? What happened? You were excited. Your wife was jumping next to you. Give him time. Give him time. You, she was shaking to me. You were shaking too. It was a very nice uh, act from you to jump like a monkey. Okay, we got it. And now time to give you time. Go ahead. You, you, are, you decide to leave. You know why? You cannot even find the verses. Admit, did you find the verses? Sorry, CP. I have found Did you find the verses? No, before you go. Admit, did you, did you find the verses? Be honest with me. Did you know the verses? Be honest. Do you know the verses? I will, I will not explain more. Next day I will explain. No, no, be honest. No, no, no. No, no, no. no. Okay, you, you, okay, you want to leave. You want to leave. No problem. Do you know the verses? Be honest with me. Do you know the verses you were talking about? Yes, I know the verses, but I don't want to say no. You know the verses, you don't say? But a second ago, five minutes ago, you said you do not know them. Okay, la, I have something to do. Sorry for that. So no, no. Why you uh, said five minutes ago? Uh, why, why you said five minutes ago? You do not know them. Why you, why you align a five minutes ago? He covers me. He said he don't know them. Later he will find them. Now he says he know them, but he will not say them. I mean, look how powerful he is. And his wife, she start jumping. Give him time. Give him time. Give him time. Anger. And the funny they say that the Christian prince he don't have patience with Muslims. And you notice how fast he starts talking. And we are following Paul. I said, okay, prove it. What, what do you mean follow Paul? We don't follow Jesus. What is the teaching of Paul which is against the teaching of Jesus? You see, many of you Christians, you say, let him go, let him go. The same as like David Wood yesterday. He let the guy go. You remember yesterday they have a Abdul, they let him go. In the moment where it's time to get him busted, don't do that. Don't do that. Can you imagine how embarrassing it is that somebody saying to you, "Please stay, give us, give us the verses at least," and then you say, uh, well, "I will not give them." A second ago he was so excited. Do you know why he did not give them? Because simply he looked at them both are saying the same. Very embarrassing. And if you do not know them, even that is more horrible. Paul is one of the most amazing church father teachers. And those who say he was not one of the disciples, that's absolutely false. Because the Bible confirmed that the Messiah, our Lord, he appeared to Paul and he blinded him. And then he gave him his eyes again. So yes, he met the Messiah. He met our Lord. The you know the only bad thing when you speak to Muslims, you have to shout a lot, and you know it's a, it's kind of headache. But I used to it. I mean, this is how they are. And the hypocrisy always appear when you ask them, okay, who is the one who agree with you in what you said as a Muslim? Nobody. Suddenly he have a new religion. It's called Islamic Islam religion of Budi, the sect of Budi, <coughs> new sect. He have his own interpretation for the Quran. You guys, when the Quran says the judgment day is near and the moon split, he was talking about NASA when they went to the moon and they took a rock. You remember? And we showed him this is a past tense. You idiot. He says yes, it's past tense, but it happened now. <laughs> Oh boy. But this is a great example for Christians to show you how Muhammadan they fabricate answers have nothing to do with their religion. Never take a Muhammadan answer. They play like a snake. They change their skin. They bend in the conversation. After talking all this time with him, maybe it may be this. It may be that, but he never gave us an answer. 
and he re rejected any interpretation, any hadith. All right, now we have to cut this video because it became so long. And uh, honestly, I am not really interested of this uh, sad guru stuff. But for the Christians, don't make those people fool you, sad guru or sad duru. Those are false teachers. They speak philosophy and their philosophy is awkward. Mean nothing, teach nothing. <coughs> You know, through history, there is a philosopher who who can, you know, let us say, he spent his time speaking about something meaningless, it, it, but yet it's philosophy. You know, uh, and philosophy what made the Greek people uh, live in a fantasy, you know, like uh, Venus, and it's, uh, this is philosophy. You know, they try to find the philosophy of a beauty and sex, and etc. So they have their own fantasia of things. Yoga and philosophy of the Hindus is no different. Energy of a man, energy of the women, the stone of sex dancing together, the energy, and energy came around Shiva and danced around him, and he was a shower, whatever I mean. It's, it's just a empty words. There's no proof of it. It's a statement written by somebody. Maybe it's taking too much hashish. And then they try to implement that in your head today. But it's meaningless, it's useless. Be aware of false teachers. Doesn't matter who they are. Muslims, Hindu, even Christians, who said that the Christians, all the Christians, they are good teachers. How we knew if somebody is a false teacher? Anyone knows? Additional to the fruits. The Bible says anyone bring us other than these scriptures is a false teacher. So anyone he teach something against what the Bible teach is a false teacher as simple as that Paul in order for him to be a false teacher he had to teach against the Bible the four Gospels but he never did he never ever did actually a disciple of Christ their problem with Paul that he is so strict he don't compromise and you know those who don't compromise is the true believer he is so true believer to the point he want to take it all the way to the end. Like you know, there is a there, there is a there, there is a carpenter when he make a, a door, he he put a nail in the door, you know, and there is a one of them he want to put the nail, but he want to be sure that the nail is going in all the way. Both of them they are doing great job. Both of them they are making a door for you, but there is one he is so conservative. He want to be sure that this nail will never be moving. That is Paul. Many do not like Paul because Paul speak against gambling, being a drunk. And there's many people, they are fake. They want to be gambling. They want to be drunk. So what, what do you mean? Those who they are drunk and those who do gambling, they will not go to heaven. They don't like that. So you will notice that those who reject Paul is those who they are looking for sinful freedom. How I can be free from Paul? But Jesus said the same. The Bible, the Old Testament says the same. But they don't want Paul because Paul is like there's somebody his clothes is so dirty and somebody, his clothes is so clean. And then we put them together. Just by putting that person next to me and he's so clean and I'm so dirty, it's embarrassing to me. So I feel in, I feel offended by having the person with the clean clothing next to me. So I try to get rid of him. Not because he did anything bad, but because it's embarrassing. He is so clean and I'm so dirty. So the dirty person, he tried to get rid of the clean person because the clean person make him look so bad he don't want that and this is what Paul he do he say it as it is he is not perfectly correct Paul if he come in our time he will be killed after three days maximum three days maximum 
And remember, those amazing disciples, they got killed. So they got killed in the end anyway. Not because they are bad, but because they are bad for that time. The bad people reject the good teaching. The bad people, they want to go and get drunk. They want to sleep around. They don't want somebody to say to them, you cannot do that, you will go to hell. They want somebody to say to them, don't worry. Like today, you will see many, uh, many false priests like Muhammad. Oh, Allah, you forget all, all sin. Anything you do, don't worry, just say Shahada. You know? Okay, well, God, our God, he forgets, uh, forgives sin too. But doesn't mean that you can fool God. Doesn't mean if you are a Christian, you can be a drug dealer and you hang a cross in your chest and you say, okay, I believe in Jesus, I will go to heaven anyway. It doesn't work this way. There's many liars and bad people, they are looking for a person to give them comfort of their sin, not somebody to rebuke them and say to them, shame on you. They want a priest to agree with them whatever they do, like these days. The guy, he had a girlfriend, the man, he etc. We commit sin, and then the priest, he said, it's okay, it's fine. He don't, he don't say to me, it's wrong, you cannot do it. Stop doing that. No, it's okay to have a, do whatever you want. And yes, all of us, we commit sin. All of us, we get tempted. All of us, men and women, we do. But there's a huge difference of adopting sin and making it as a, the best way to live. And knowing that this is wrong and we fight it, we resist it. And a priest who says to us, don't do that. And a priest who says to us, don't worry, do it, it's okay. And this is what they do to you through the yoga, by the way. If you go and see the, uh, the, 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 the yoga class, I mean, it's embarrassing. It's very, it's, sometimes they do sexual yoga. Very disgusting. It's a change partner. Well, did you try to change your husband for a day or two? <laughs> to refresh your life? This is Muhammad. Multiple husbands, multiple wives. There's no thing, it's nothing is called marriage sexual freedom, yet they claim that they are conservative. Muta, you rent women for sex. Yet they claim that women, women in Islam is like a jewel. Where is the jewel? If you have a jewel, you don't put her for sale. If the jewel means something to you, you sell it out only if it is just a product. And it's what you do for women. You buy them, you sell them, and you cover them in boxes because they are property. God did not create a woman, put her inside the box. God, he gave the woman her cover. It is her hair, her glory. God, he blessed the woman with the beauty she has. Why you want to cover her? If the beauty is a shame, that's mean God is a shame. For God is a beautiful too. But because this religion is a pure sexual cult, so the woman, she became a sexual object. All of her is a vagina. Even in heaven, she is just a sex toy. She is not there for herself. She is there for somebody else's entertainment. While with Christ and Paul, he agreed with every word of Christ. He said that the woman, she is equal to the church. The same as the Messiah, he sacrificed himself to the church. This is how the man, he sacrificed himself to his wife. Sacrificing is the ultimate love. You see, when somebody sacrifice himself to someone else, I mean, he can't get back to get reward because he sacrificed himself. That's it. It's over. He's dead. How he can get back reward? That's the amazing love. And this is what Jesus, he said, and he did. And he asked the man, to be the same as he did to the church with his wife. A love without return. So we, as a Christians, we are the same as every human being. We get tempted. A man be tempted by women. Women will be tempted by a man. We get tempted by money. We get tempted by power, whatever. We get tempted. But we don't make the temptation 
the true way of living. We agree it is wrong. We agree we should fight it. We agree that we don't belong to it and it doesn't belong to us. We don't make it coming from God and say, Oh God, he made me like this and I will do it, that's it. This is what Muhammad do. He promised the man for women at the same time. Why? Why you need for women? What four women can do, a, a woman she cannot do. One woman, she can do what four women can do. Are we goats? Are we cattle? Are we chickens? What is the purpose of marriage then? There's no marriage in this marriage. There's a group sex. You see, the Muhammadan, they speak about Western, they do like a group sex. Well, if, they, if there is some people, they do that, and yes, there is. Will you do that too? Four wives, one man, is group sex. As simple as that. The second you have multiple partners, you are doing group sex, even if you don't do it in the same room. If you sleep with the women now, and then you sleep with other women after two hours or second day, this is a group sex. Because you have multiple partners. Four wives is group sex. In heaven is a group sex. And why sex is so much important in this cult because this cult it's a cult speak to your stomach Allah will give you shish kebab falafel hummus in the heaven and sex this is what the man he want every man he want that every man have a dreams so the, the, the Satan he speak your dreams the fantasy to have many women and all of them, they are praising you. You are, if you read, if you read my book, Six on Allah, you will see how the women, each time the man he have sex with her, she said to him, "You are the best one." He is doing it. I'm not going to say what you know. You can read the book, but you can use your imagination when he is doing it. So she keeps saying to him, "Oh boy, you are the best. You are the best." But imagine the hypocrisy in this book. If the woman she is programmed to say he is the best, that's mean. All of them they are lying because everybody in heaven is not the best then. Because you are the best is said for all. You know what I mean? If those women they are going to say you are the best when they are doing doom boom boom, to each man he sleep with them. That's mean Allah is forcing them to lie because they say the same to all the men. What kind of cult this cult is? How stupid it is. You are the best. You are the best in what? In boom boom. Not the best in wisdom, in how kind you are. No, in boom boom. So even the quality is about boom boom. Why did make, uh, God make Adam? Make only E for Adam. Why not for wise? Yeah. If, if uh, actually at that time it made more sense if God created more women to Adam, right? So he can multiply the children faster. But even at that time, he did not. And this is contradict the story of Muhammadan because Muhammadan, they believe in the story of Adam, so, supposedly. So the time when God, he needed Adam to have more children to multiply the earth, the population, he created still one, one Eve. Very stupid. Anyway, uh, I'm going to do editing for this video so you can download only the part where this booty he called. So I'm going to cut, cut it off. All right. I don't know how long it's going to be uh, to cut it off and make it ready. But I will use uh, uh, Google, uh, I mean YouTube Studio to do it. All right, guys, F don't forget to download the video after we, you know, when it's ready about Budi Nudi, the Dudi, and post it in your uh, Indonesian and let everybody laugh and see how those Indonesians, they bring nothing but shame to Islam. They have nothing to say. They have nothing to teach. What do you think, guys? Should I leave uh, the sad guru? I think it's not important. I don't think it's really important. I just wanted to share about this guy. This guy, he talked too much. He said nothing. All right? So I want to say thank you for being here. And I pray that the Lord will open the eyes of this poor booty, poor guy. Very embarrassing. And we pray for all Muslims to see the truth, and the truth will set them free. Never hate the Muslims, we don't hate them. Even they pray for our death, etc. Because hate is satanic.
Hate is satanic, and we don't belong to Satan. And hate will not help us. If somebody wanna commit a crime, or he have hate in his heart, God will do just with him. Leave him to God. One day they will stand in front of the Lord with their hate, and they will pay for it. And if you think there's someone better than God can be justice with those who they are bad, you are mistaken. So don't worry about them. Whatever they say, throw it in your back. Learn how to defeat the lies and how to prove the truth. And the truth will set you free. Thank you very much for being here. May the Lord bless you. Christ is Lord. Islam is false. And we see you soon again. Bye-bye.